Now, from the Mel Johnson Studios at the University of Northwestern, this is Eagle 7 News. Good morning, Eagles, and welcome to Chapel. I'm Joe Sutton. And I'm Lauren Griggs. It's a brand new school year and students begin classes at Northwestern. Freshmen are finding their way around dorms and classrooms while seniors are getting their resumes ready. Lizzie Earhart has a story. I'm here in the Billy Graham Center on Northwestern's campus and three weeks into classes, we figured it was about time to catch up with some of Northwestern's newest members, the freshman class. Did I like being homeschooled? I really enjoyed being homeschooled, yeah. Was I homeschooled? No. I was not homeschooled. I was not homeschooled. I wasn't homeschooled. Northwestern is pretty cool. Uh, the education here is really great. I really like going to the stud, the student center, and going to hang out with people and do some homework, but mostly hanging out. So far my favorite part has been the food. I've been really enjoying that a lot. Boy, my favorite part of being here at Northwestern would probably have to be meeting all the new people and just kind of exploring the cities. I love the campus. It's beautiful. I won't have a ring by this spring, but I'm not putting off the possibility that in the few springs up ahead. I most definitely will not have a ring by spring. <laughs> hey, you can get that ring by spring? And I'm like, yeah, it's not going to happen. It's wonderful to see that the freshmen are enjoying their time on Northwestern's campus, but it seems like most of our homeschoolers are still in hiding. I'm Lizzie Earhart with Eagle 7 News. And for all you upperclassmen, are you looking for an internship? The Center for Calling and Career will be hosting the Hire an Eagle Career and Internship Fair on Wednesday, September 30th from 12 to 4 in the NAS Great Room. This fair focuses on internships and entry-level jobs in the for-profit sector. Students from all majors and programs are welcome and no registration is required. Campaign posters are popping up and t-shirts are being worn around campus this week. Election season is upon us and it's almost time to vote for your new student government representatives. Northwestern is definitely a quiet spot when it comes to campaigning, but a few new faces are already trying to make a difference. Eagle 7 caught up with student body president Kayla Vinberg to talk about the upcoming elections. I think that is important for freshmen to run for student government because it brings in um, a very new perspective. A lot of people are coming from a lot of different places and it just gives us new perspective um, regarding areas of campus that can be improved, so food service or public safety or things like that. Voting is open on the Rock September 23rd through 24th. Students flooded the Student Center for the event Swing Dance in the Stud this week. That's right, student activities reserved the stud so that students could showcase their dance skills. And people were just telling me that there, there was a big interest in a swing dance on campus. And so I thought having it in a centralized location like the stud would be a good idea. If you're looking to hit the dance floor regularly, there is a UNW Swing Dance Club. It meets every Sunday night in the Udarian Lounge. Contact Michaela Case for more information. And now for this week's weather. Hannah, what do you have for us? Thank you, Lauren. I'm Hannah Swanson, and this year we have a new feature on Eagle 7 called Hometown Weather. This hometown weather is from Bruno, Minnesota, my hometown, and the high is supposed to be 66 degrees and sunny. Here at Northwestern, it looks like it's gonna be cloudy and 66 degrees for the high today. Perfect flannel weather, I could not be more excited. For the rest of the week, Saturday, it looks like it's gonna be 70 degrees, mostly sunny. Sunday, 72, Monday, 77, Tuesday, high of 79. Get that sun before it's too late. Wednesday, 75, and Thursday, 73. Also, T minus one month and two weeks till hunting season open here, so keep an eye out for that. Back to you guys. Thanks, Hannah. Not really a big hunter, but I'll be looking out for that. But it's one of the biggest admission events of the fall, and organizers say it was a big hit. Prospective students and their fam families gathered at the Billy last Saturday to kick off Football Frenzy. Northwestern students and faculty were there to welcome them with multiple academic booths and campus tours. Close to 1,000 prospective students were registered to attend the event, double the numbers organizers say they had last year. The event concluded with the football game. And... It was a pretty good game, too. Let's bring in Brennan Scarborough with the sports. Thanks, Joe. This past week has been a great week for Eagle sports. Eagle football hosted Crown College for Football Frenzy last week Saturday. The atmosphere was electrifying as the Eagles outplayed the Storm 35-13. The Eagles hit the road as they take on the Minnesota Morris Cougars on Saturday. Men's soccer has been on a winning streak, shutting out Morris 1-0 last Saturday bouncing back and defeating North Central 2-0 
at home. The men's next game will be against St. Scholastica at 2 p.m. Women's soccer has been busy playing three games in the last four days last Saturday. They battled with Morris and unfortunately lost 2-0. They made a tremendous comeback, beating Bethany Lutheran 4-1 and shut out North Central 1-0 the day after. The women will get a nice break until next Tuesday when they host Hamlin Uni University. Excuse me. Volleyball participated in the Osberg tournament last week and went 1-3 in the tournament. But that didn't stop them as they went on the road to make an un outstanding comeback, winning the match 3-2. to Congrats to sophomore Jackie Foster on receiving the UMAC Defensive Player of the Week. The Eagles will host Martin Luther and Morris today at 5 and 7. That's all for sports. Back to you, Joe. Thanks, Brennan. Pretty, this is going to be a pretty big weekend for sports and everything. Student government coming up. Yeah, elections are next week, it looks like. Yeah. And that'll be exciting for all you new students. Looks like another good year is starting here at Northwestern. I'm Lauren Griggs. And I'm Joe Sutton. Thanks for joining us. And always remember, stay fly, Eagles.